everyone today I'm, I am gonna do something a little bit different it's not about fishing but it's also seafood okay look what I got look at that credit okay I'm gonna I'm gonna clean it up and we're gonna boil and make me um, I've been wanting to try credit laps so I'm gonna do that so I hope you guys will like it all right stay tuned for more I hope I won't disappoint you guys. Thank you. See you soon. Okay. Alright, I start by cleaning them off the mud, the mud off of them. Look at how beautiful they are, how active alive they are. Really big. It's my easy way. There's one way to do it. Alright, gotta put the water between my legs to do this. Ready? Look at that. Got a big papa right here. Here's a mummy. The claws are small. Oops. There we go. Mm, gotta get all this grass out. Thanks to my friend. I didn't have to go get it. <laughs> okay. There's a lot of tiny grasses, so I just have to pick them one by one. Usually they're not that many. Too grassy and it's a lot easier to clean by bunch. Got a few dead ones, but that's not bad. It's expected. You can't get every one of them to be alive from a long transport. I eat this little guy, but it's a lot of work here too. <laughs> so you want to rinse until like the water bottle, the water on the bottom is kind of cleared up. Okay. I'm not sure what it means to this bucket. Get some of my lemongrass leaves. You gotta be careful when you pick the lemongrass. The leaves are very sharp. You can easily cut yourself. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, add that one's on there. I'm gonna take this bucket here and go put in the boiling water that I have prepared. Okay, that's the pot I had it boiling. Now, 
hold them in there. Perfect pot. Got my lemongrass in there. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna add salt to this, the water. It's a big pot, so can't hurt to put too much. I mean, I'm not gonna drink the juice. I just want some flavor onto the meat. And then here's a the butter. Put that in there to make it look shiny and hopefully be more flavorful. Okay, I'll shoot, I shall see you soon. Be right back. Here is boiling. It's looking good. It's been for about 10 minutes or so right now. I'm going to let it boil a little longer. In the meantime, I'm going to turn them over. Oh, look at that. That does look delicious. Put the butter on them. Mm, mm, mm. I'm going to make some pepper, make some lab, and make, I'm going to eat some that just dip into the pepper sauce. Okay. All right. I'm going to go make pepper while this one is still boiling. some fresh garlic this I harvested from my garden they're not like big big but they're still all good edible my soy in the garden is not as good not as rich so it doesn't grow that big Here's some frozen pepper that I harvest and save it. Okay. okay. I always put salt first to help because it's a frozen and you can cr uh, crush them easier. And here's the MSG. pound them against the wall so they break and with the saw it helps to um, stay kind of still against the wall too okay that looks crush enough when you make the sauce, I like to use a little bit of older cilantro, like how this one. See when they a little bit older, and then the leaves kind of start to split into smaller pieces. That's where later on the seeds will come out from there. But they're just regular cilantro. When it, when it gets older, then they have the long, the, the leaves split into smaller sizes. I could use a cutting board, but I just like to do things easier since I'm going to crush them anyway, so they don't need to be cut fine. Mm. 
And then add a little bit of tamarind soup base, just a little bit, not too much because you don't want it too sour. You put a little bit of water. Mmm, what do you think? What do you think that the sauce is? Okay. Mmm, it looks good to me. If you like to, if you like it sweet, you can add a little bit of sugar on this one. But not the rest. This I'm gonna, oops, I'm gonna save this one for later. Some store those one. This will be with the cut. Ah, oh, nice and golden. This is ready. So I'm gonna take it out. It is so hot out here, I'm just cooking out here. Please don't say I'm mean, okay? This is the freshness you can get. You can't have them all dying and cook because when once they're dead, when you cook, they're not the same thing. They won't taste the same. So these are a few of the things that you have to cook them alive. If you want them dead and then cook, I don't know. They won't be the same. Okay, here. Yeah. I got the sauce down. I want to have a few with the sauce. Okay. Oh, this is going to be hot and juicy. Mmm. Oh, that's so good. Spicy. Just enough flavor. A little bit sour. A little bit sour. Hit the spot. Okay, let me have a couple more. Only I wish you guys were here. You could share with me. Uh, Alex coming home soon, so he's going to share with me too. Mmm, look at that soup. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, that's good. Fresh out the pot, dip on the sauce. Some of you will do like a Cajun style. This is kind of like Cajun, but without all the, all the soupy and all that stuff. Oh, look at that. Mm, let me eat this big one. Okay. There we go. Ooh, it's hot now. Getting to my ears. Yeah, that's enough. I'll see you soon. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna add dry fried garlic. You add whatever a portion you like. You want to add more, you add more. Homemade ground peppers. If you like it spicy, you add more. That's, that's 
smells really good. I also had the fried onions, onion bobs. Of course, we always use this. I always use the seasoning. Lap nam tok. Can't miss the MSG. The basil was I like to just like take it apart. Okay. to do the same thing with the cilantro. You can cut it small. You can cut it into smaller pieces if you want. And hey, why don't I do that? Let me just cut it. You don't have to cut it fine. I like my herbs a little bit more. Very good. So that way you can taste them. There's peppers in there, so you don't want to get your hand burned. And later you might forget and you might rub in your eyes, then that would be a very bad thing. Okay. Mm, that smells so good. You got the fried garlics on there, the fried uh, onion bars. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's have a sample. Look at that. How about that one? Mmm. Mmm. That's yummy. Imagine this with rice and your beer, sit out there with your buddies. Okay, same point. Mm -hmm. Oh, you dropped. Oh, you hear that crunchy? Mm. Crunchy with the... Mmm. Oh, gosh. Gotcha. Oh, good. Mmm. Mmm. That's a lot of food. <laughs> oh, yeah. Really good. You guys should try it. Mm -hmm. This is pretty awesome. Yeah. Mmm. Yeah, put some more on that. Mmm, yummy. Okay. Well, I hope you guys like this uh, little ingredients here. This little spice, um, dish. I usually just make soup, but today I just feel like, okay, maybe do, do like a cabbage wrap or something. So, it's pretty good. Alright. Okay, dinner is served. I hope everybody liked the show. And um, if you ever come across credits again, give it a try. And don't forget.
to uh, hit the subscribe button for more future edition videos of fishing, sometimes cooking, and everything. All right, see you next time.